Hello everybody, welcome to the channel SRS. This is Sumit Roy and we are studying today uh, VLSI design in that uh, flip flops that is SR and JK flip flop. Okay, let us start. I will draw the uh, clogged version for SR flip flop, it will be of more use. So, SR flip flop clogged version. With the clock, that is. First of all, we'll draw the basic logic diagram. Logic uh, diagram of our SR flip flop. It will be consisting of can be used uh, can be constructed with the help of NAND gate and OR and NAND both. So I'll deal with the NAND gate first. I'll use NAND gate. S and R and I'll use lock and then there will be NAND gates and this will be Q and Q bar. This is the basic uh, diagram for SR uh, flip flop or latch, whatever it is. So, this gives us uh, the basic uh, mathematics, this, the basic uh, Boolean logic. What we get from this is S clock bar, this is R dot clock bar, and this is already Q, and this is already Q bar. So, what we get is actually Q as S dot clock bar dot q bar whole bar is q. Similarly here what we get is r dot clock bar dot q bar whole bar. This is actually q bar. So this is the boolean logic we get. Another diagram uh, if we use nor gate instead of nand gate uh, sorry or gate instead of nand gate we can also get back to the uh, this uh, same sr flip flop only. So, and NAND gate. The rest part will be same. And this will be Q and Q bar. In this case, it will be S plus clock, R plus clock, and this will be Q bar and Q as usual. So, what we will get as S plus clock dot Q bar whole bar, and Q bar will be R plus clock dot Q whole bar. So, this will be the outcome of SR uh, flip flop or latch. So based on this, actually based on this and this, we will construct the uh, layout and uh, stick diagram and all. That is first we will start with the CMOS uh, detection. Now what we are having is, we will start with this only, we will consider this only. So what we are having is Q equal to S plus clock dot q bar bar and similarly q bar as r plus clock dot q bar. So we are having this. Now what we can do is CMOS diagram. For this CMOS diagram will be S plus clock. So directly I will start the CMOS diagram plus clock, so means clock made it here, make it here, followed by Q bar and this will be the ground. So and the PMOS part of this will be S 
एस एंड क्लॉक आर इन पैरल सो एस एंड क्लॉक आर इन सीरीज एंड क्यू बार इज इन सीरीज टू एट सो क्यू बार विल बी इन पैरल सो आई शिफ्ट इट लिटिल बिट and now the pmos part so this is the diagram uh, for s plus clock dot q bar so s plus uh, clock dot q bar so this is output is yielding us q this is q so this is nothing but q same thing that is uh, for the q bar part here i'll draw it that is r and there is plus clock with it so clock and then there is dot q with it dot q with it and directly to the pmos part that is there is r and clock are in parallel so r and clock will be in series r and clock are in series and q is in parallel q is in parallel and the output yields us q bar so output yields us q bar so this is the basic diagram Uh, for cmos diagram basic cmos diagram there will be vdd here also now if we connect whatever it is that is clock clock so both the clocks can be connected there is q bar there is q bar there is q bar so or in the cross direction also we can do that so it's up to you that is q bar q bar q bar similarly q q and q and s and s and r and r so this is the diagram that is thus we are having what s and there is clock and there is r and there is q bar and there is q so this is the diagram 
that is having S, R, Q, Q bar and clock. So, this is the basic CMOS diagram and stick diagram and layout can be constructed from this stick diagram only, from this uh, CMOS diagram only. This is SR, same logic can be implemented for this uh, Boolean logic and uh, now we will deal with JK flip flop in the next class. Till then, goodbye, consider subscribing. If there are any doubts, uh, leave them on the comment box, I will try to answer most of them. Thank you.